It's an unusual way to say goodbye, but today a Metro Vancouver man dying of cancer gathered his friends and family together for a living wake. Music is a big part of 40-year-old Chris Walter's life. My guitars and my music are all what made me whole again. But this is one of the last times he will play this instrument. This one is going to Jacob, my cousin. Today he is giving away the things he cherishes to people he loves during his own living wake. He's still alive and he gets to see everyone and everyone gets to see him and have this time. It's Chris was diagnosed last November with stage 4 colon cancer. After learning the heartbreaking news, one of the first things that he and Yana Bielman did was get married. With this ring. With this ring. I choose to love you. I choose to love you. And they did so in a memorable way on board an aqua bus in Vancouver, live streaming the ceremony on Facebook. And it's been a, an amazingly beautiful thing, right? Because she's, you know, stepped up further than anyone I could imagine. After his diagnosis, Chris tried treatment. By round seven of chemotherapy, I just couldn't keep it going. He stopped the chemo. When he was well enough, the couple went away enjoying a honeymoon. It's also been a time for him to learn some valuable life lessons and develop his own mantra. Just judge less and love more. Now this couple faces his next step, a living wake. It, we had slowly started talking about this a couple months ago, and it, it's like, oh, who would you come, who would you invite? And I just put it out there, and so many people were interested. Though unusual for Chris, a living wake makes sense. But this is as real as you can get it, where we can actually get in and hug and ask a question. And With family and friends coming to see him, it is a chance to celebrate his life while he can still be with them on a day he believes will bring him closure.